Are you tired of your Linux system crashing when you least expect it? We are diving deep into Linux Mint 22.1 and 22.2 .2 to uncover which version truly delivers long-term stability. If you are looking for an operating system that won't let you down after months of years, this comparison is essential viewing. Don't pick the wrong Mint for your daily driver. Welcome to the Great Mint Tibet. Linux Mint 22.1 versus 22.2 .2 with a sharp focus on a long-term stability. Why does stability matter so much in your daily Linux experience? Well, whether you are a developer crunching code, a creative professional editing videos, or just someone browsing the web and managing files, you need an operating system that stays reliable over time, without random freezes, driver conflicts, or escalating bugs that creep in after updates. Long-term stability means fewer headaches, less troubleshooting, and more productivity. It's the foundation of a trustworthy desktop. To set the stage, let's talk about our testing methodology. For this comparison, we drawn from real-world user reports across forums like Reddit and the official Linux Mint community, X, which is formerly Twitter discussions, and hands-on evaluations. We looked at stress tests, simulating extended use, like running resource-intensive apps for hours handling multiple hardware configurations, and monitoring system logs for crashes or incompatibilities. We also reviewed official release notes and benchmarks to ensure a balanced view. This isn't just theory. It's grounded in practical reliability over months of operation. First, a quick recap of what 22.1 brought to the table. It released in January 2025. Linux Mint 22.1 CR built on the solid Ubuntu 24.04 LTS space, introducing refinements to the Cinnamon desktop, improved VLAN support for smoother graphics performance, and updated software packages. It shipped with the LTS kernel 6.8, emphasizing compatibility and bug fixes from its producers, making it a strong contender for users prioritizing a set-it-and-forget-it setup. Many users praised its out-of-the-box stability, especially on mid-range hardware. Now, under the hood, the core differences and what they mean for long-term expectations. Both versions share the same Ubuntu 24.04 foundation, so they are supported until 2029 with security updates and patches. However, 22.2 Sera, released in September 2025, introduces key upgrades. The most notable is the shift of the hardware enablement, which is HWE kernel 6.14, which provides better support for newer processors, like recent AMD chips, and includes performance tweaks for graphics and networking. Package bases see variations too. 22.2 .2 updates Mesa graphics drivers to 25.0.7 for enhanced rendering stability and adds native fingerprint authentication for quicker logins. UI refinements in Cinnamon 6.4 make the desktop feel more polished, with better theme consistency and minor bug squashes. Theoretically, 22.2 .2 should edge out in stability for users with modern hardware, thanks to these updates addressing emerging issues in kernel and drivers. But for older setups, the newer kernel could introduce dependencies conflicts like problems with VirtualBox or legacy NVIDIA 470 drivers. If your system relies on those, 22.1's more conservative kernel might feel safer long term, avoiding potential regressions. Moving to the stability showdown, real world grained. In our analysis of user reports and benchmarks, both versions perform admirably under stress. For instance, long-term tests running virtual machine, video encoding, and web servers showed minimal crashes. 22.1 averaged near zero freezes on standard hardware, while 22.2 .2 matched it but shone brighter on newer AMD or Intel rigs with fewer thermal throttling incidents. Driver compatibility is a mixed bag. 22.2 .2 handles diverse setups better overall thanks to updated firmware, but some users on X reported occasional NVIDIA glitches or virtual box hangs 
that were in present in 22.1 software compatibility over months popular apps like firefox libreoffice and gimp run smoothly on both with 22.2 package tweaks reducing rare dependencies conflicts in tools like rocm for ai workloads anecdotal evidence for forums highlights 22.2 as slightly more resilient to update induced issues but 22.1 holds its own for conservative users now the verdict who wins the stability crown in a direct comparison linux mint 22.2 takes the edge for ultimate long term reliability its newer kernel and refinements address more potential pain points making it the clear winner for most users seeking future proof stability that said use case matters if you are on a older hardware or value absolute caution 22.1 might still be preferable as its lts kernel avoids the rare incompatibilities in 22.2 for daily drivers go with 22.2 for servers or legacy systems stick to 22.1 until you are ready to test the waters now your next move choosing wisely if upgrading back up with time shift first it's built in and lets you roll back easily for a safe upgrade from 22.1 to 22.2 use the update manager it's straightforward and preserves your settings now about the fresh installs download the iso from the official site and verify it to future proof your mint experience enable automatic snapshots keep kernels updated selectively and monitor hardware specific forums for tips and remember a reliable operating system like mint is the bedrock for a productive digital life pick the version that fits your setup and you will be set for years thanks for watching if this helped like subscribe and drop a comment on your mint experiences see you in the next video peace out